Frost Crown, Pandora's Items 3, and the Lucky Gloves, guys. We're also on the completed item anvil. Portal. And we have a little bit of an encounter start. Don't worry, I will explain the trade if you haven't seen this set yet. Frost Crown. No. Birthday present to build a bug. This ain't build a bud, a bud. You don't get to pick and choose bigger ass or bigger boobs. Birthday present or that? I like build a bud more, frick it. Build a bud. You don't get to pick and choose. Na, 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 na. I'm a freaking idiot. Yeah, I mean, I have a full win streak guaranteed, right? Okay, I have a full win streak guaranteed. I'm back, gain a temporary remover and reforge. I should, probably should have reforged glove. I didn't see the charm in time. Okay, I mean, I have a guaranteed fast nine win streak, right? Level four making 10 because build about also gives you money. Eight gold, very, very nice augment. I like this more and more. Then we have an additional Blitzcrank, which doesn't matter. Okay. And then we just add Honeymancy, which is going to give us these little bees. That are going to do a bunch of damage. This is a better Blaster. Or a better Vanguard. Um, my Blitzcrank is a Vanguard, which allows him to get a percentage health shield. And also gain damage reduction while he's shielded. He also conveniently has a shield as his ultimate ability. Very nice. Good build about. Honestly, amazing build about. Ionic Spark, Gargoyles there, frick it. Good enough, bro. Good enough, honestly. Good freaking build about. And then we instantly hit the two star Ziggs, which is gonna be our carry for now. Uh, Ziggs with Encanter. The Encanters gain bonus AP. Up to 40 bonus AP. <laughs> Oh, I'm live? Oh, I already started the stream. Sorry, guys. I apologize, guys. Sorry. Sorry, guys. Ooh. I mean, two star is better. And then, honestly, just level, right? Honey Mancy. Honey Mancy, we get the bees which deal a uh, percentage damage according to how much damage the unit is taking or how much damage it's dealing or both together. So him taking damage is gonna make the bees return a lot. And then um, we put the Kog'Maw in the middle between them because Kog'Maw's ability gives attack speed to the left and right of him. We can sell the Zoe, it really doesn't do anything. Our hero augments only 2-1. Yes, the carry augments are, for one cost champions, are only at stage 2-1. So I cannot get the carry augment for Blitzcrank. Which I assume what you're, is what you were um, implying. There is, you can get uh, the two cost carry augments at stage 3-2. Which in that case are the plus version of them. Which gives you um, a two star of that two cost unit. For example, a two star Nunu. I could get a Nunu carry augment, for example. But we don't want that. We just want to go fast 9. We do not want to roll anymore. We just want to go fast nine with this incredible early game that we have. <clears throat> so we have an Ionic Spark, so we want, um, you know, AP items. We'll see if we can get them. It's going to be tough, though. No, the tier is already gone. I did not get Shoujin. Guess I'll take a cloak. What the frick is this? It's as I mean, like, gain a random minor. Gain a random minor wish, minor effect. Gain a random minor, guys. And if you hear that hotline bling, 
They can only mean one thing. Yeah. Wait, what did I get? Oh, this guy got stronger for a turn or what? Sure. Guys, I need to iterate that joke again more. Because I already did the hotline bling version of it. Like I already did the same the same joke already. I need to think about new stuff. I don't li really listen to Drake, you know. Oh man, I need to figure out some new things. Oh, I can do the Gillette one. Raul, Gillette, the best a man can get. Raul, Gillette. You know we can do that one. That's pretty good. Ah oh, man, I'm back, guys. Back again. Yeah. Nice guys, let's go. There's so there's infinite ver <laughs> this this year 2024 you can make infinite versions of that joke, man. It's crazy guys. Oh man. Oh man, then I can add some jacks in there, you know? Jacks mains. Oh man, it's not bad. Alright guys. Let's freaking go, man. Let's go, go. I want to hold this guy. I mean, there's no way I lose, right? Like, I don't want to give anyone a sword. Like, I'm, I'm playing AP, right? Like, I have an Ionic Spark, bro. I have to play AP. But at the end of the day, you know, it is what it is. Like, I, like it is what it is. At the end of the day, it is what it is, man. If I don't get a Shoujin here, I'm not playing AP. Oh, okay. Now I'm, I, I'm down to play AD. I'm actually down. If I get AD items, because like if you go fast nine, you can always use a spark. Like you think you're going fast nine and not playing Diana, you can just give her a spark. Give her a spark, right? It's not even that bad. Like you'll probably play him. You'll probably play him. And then even if you play AD carries like these guys, right? It doesn't even matter, man. Like you, like you, you can still use a spark. It's not even that bad. I almost felt that. Oh, frick, what are those, man? I mean, can we go hurricane on something? I'm sure it's not that bad. Your bees gain 50% attack speed this round. <laughs> It's kind of cute. I mean, we buy it, right? We could play Preserver. Bro, I'm pretty sure it's a hurricane slam. Like, what the frick is this, though? That's not really good. But, like, I'm pretty sure it's a hurricane slam, man. Like, think about it. What else do I do there? I'm going fast 9 anyway. It's all good. I just need to reach fast 9. And the hurricane is decent on Kogma. He's a hunter. If we can somehow get hunter in, he's gonna deal bonus damage. And he's gonna get bonus attack damage. Like an arrow. Chrono? Chrono? Chrono Mage? If I had a Vagar instead of the the, the the Ziggs, I could play Chrono Mage. Recombobulator? Man, who gives a frick, man? You think I give a frick, guys? I don't give a frick. Ask me if I give a frick. I'm gonna say no. I don't give a frick, guys. Ask me if I give a frick, guys. Ask me if I give a frick. I'm gonna say no, I don't give a frick. You understand me, guys?
Just ask me if I give a frick. Just please ask me if I give a frick, guys. It's a no from me, dog. What does she need, Shojin or Blue Buff? Both are good, Shojin is slightly better. You know that was kind of good, because I still have a good tank. A 2 star, 3 cost tank. And I got a uh, shapeshifter, so he gets per per uh, bonus percentage health. Especially when he transforms, it goes higher. The Ari is actually a good carry. It's not even bad, bro. It's actually not even bad. Blaster. Probably better here. And then Frost, probably better. Blaster Frost. Frost Frost will create an Ice Soldier that will um, make the enemies uh, taunt the enemies. After we kill the first enemy each fight, you can see the Shen little Shen for us. Taunts the enemies and attacks a little bit. And um, Blasters gain bonus damage percent. And even more after they cast their ult. Or during their ult cast. Also, this was just a frick ton of gold as well, right? Recombobulator. So I'm pretty sure this is just a 4, uh, four Arcana game now, right? Like, I'm just playing something around 4 Arcana, right? Because, I mean, I have Ari, so I want to play Ari always. Like, I have a 3-star Ari, bro. We're for sure playing her. So I would like to get a Shoujin still. There's two tiers. Maybe I can get it. I hope. I get a tier here, I have a Shoujin on Ari, and she's good to go, man. She can already cook a little bit. Holy frick, it's a forced. I got a freaking rice, man. I got a four cost tier, last pick. They asked me if I give a frick, I said no. I don't give a frick, guys. You really shot with one cost lower. Scholar for more mana. So I'm playing four Arcana, right? <clears throat> four Arcana. Then I'm playing uh, obviously Diana. She's a Bastion. They gain resistances. Then we're gonna play some Vanguard. Some random freaking Vanguard. Not sure whom. Maybe Rumble? Because we can easily get Blaster then. The Ari is doing okay. Nothing too crazy. Um, maybe Blaster? Like we get easy access to Blaster? The question is which, which uh, Arcana bonus are we picking? Who wants a piece of this? Okay, so Blaster, and then we just play Schmilder. That's a lot of legendaries I need, though. And then I want to play Dragon, right? Then I want to play Dragon to get heal reduction. And then I might as well, instead of this guy, play Varus. And then we just have this team. This is a freaking solid team, guys. This is a solid freaking team, man. This is voluptuous. This is voluptuous as frick, guys. This is a solid freaking team. I lost. I lost. But he's playing reroll, um, reroll uh, multi strikers. They have the chance to hit multiple times. That's interesting. Doesn't seem that strong. Well, I'm gonna grief him. Freak you, man. Ah, it's PD. Alright, do we just play this? We don't have Vanguard then? That's okay. Uh, Vanguard is kind of a weak trait. Suffering is magic. 
What's better, Scholar or Arcana now? I mean, it's for sure this and I played this guy, right? So Arcana, depending on who you pick as the Arcana champion, it gives you different bonuses. Oh my god, it's a Prismatic Luthor. Oh frick, we're back. Oh frick, we're Giga back. We can use this so well. Oh, we can use this super well. I think I should take Mughal's Mail, right? I get infinite money this game. Trench coat. I mean, I won the game, bro. Oh my god, I'm winning the game for free. Are they on my bench? Oh, they're on my bench. It's fine. Okay, I, I can't use this yet. I need to remove the Ionic Spark off of the swing. Who, who gets the who gets the thing? So I'm pretty sure Diana gets uh, trench coat. Diana with trench coat and Ionic Spark, and then another item, Crown Guard or something, uh, ideally, and then um. Maybe Nasus just gets the Giga Tank items. Nasus gets the Giga Tank items. I buy the the freaking charm, of course, because it gives you just free money. Oh my God! It's an Arcana Crest. Oh my freaking God, man! Oh my freaking God! Nah, that's actually wild, though. Nah, you can't do that, bro. You can't just give me that. You can't just give me that though, man. You can't just freaking give me that. Like, that's actually too wild, bro. So the Arcana Crest is giving us 14% bonus damage on the entire team now. If we put it on the emblem. It's gonna give us 25 at 5 Arcana. But it's 10% per emblem. So if we get more emblems, it will go crazy. But I don't think we will choose that as our bonus. I think we will choose the Xerath bonus because I've been buying the charms. So uh, the Xerath bonus is true damage. True damage on each attack. Why am I getting so much money? What happened? Oh yeah, the... the, the Mughal's mail. Okay, I mean, this is fast 9. Level 9, I play this board. Level 10, I play probably just 3 dragon. Just play 3 dragon, I guess. Level 10. So I should have kept the Nomzi. I'm a freaking moron. Yeah, I think it's just 3 dragon at level 10, man. The dragon nears. I should have played him all along. What the, what the frick am I doing? Okay, I think it's three dragon, right? So who has the best bonus right now? So this is going to give us attack damage to all the units and damage reduction. Attack damage to all the units and damage reduction. And the Hecarim bonus. The Tom Kench's bo bonus is health based on every trait I have that isn't unique. So the Ascendant trait will not count. I don't have that many traits because I'm going vertical into Ember, uh, into um, into Arcana. How much AP is it on Ari? It's only a lot on Ari. The AP from Ari is only a lot if you have a lot of three stars. He has a two star. He has a two star Morgana. Probably recombobulated with the recombobulation charm, right? That's insane, bro. He has a two star Morgana at stage 4 3. That's a legendary. A very powerful one as well. He might actually win the game off of that. I mean, I take, I, I always take, you know, you know what I take there, man. 
you know what I take here, guys. I can get it. I don't know if I'll get it. Yeah, he took it. I think I take Rod, right? Because Rod can be a good Ari item, can also be uh, Ginsu's for Smolder. So it's good all across the board. One champion without items gains a trench coat. I'll buy it just for the uh, Zeraf Arcana bonus, right? Because I'm gonna go for that one. The more charms you bought, the more true damage on your abilities your team will get. I'm not gonna put the rod on anybody yet. <clears throat> 23 AP. And she's gaining more from all sources. She gains 30% more. Maybe that's better, and ah, it's probably the damage bonus, bro, that was stupid. Damage bonus is for sure better, I think. Damage bonus has to be better. I mean, this guy's pretty strong, he's level 8-0 gold, full committed. He's a very tanky uh, guy. He's a very tanky dude, yeah. The Ari is doing decent damage, right? She uses her League of Legends Q, that's why she's doing so much true damage. On the way back, it deals true damage. Okay, I need, um, yeah, I just go level 9, like, what can I say? Not much to say, guys. If we somehow get more emblems, then uh, we, we could maybe use that one. Uh, nah, it's just Zeroth, bro. Zeroth is gonna do, do millions of damage. Gonna add millions of damage to our team. So who gets the tank items? It's Nasus, right? Nasus full tank, and then Diana secondary tank. With trench coat, Ionic Spar. And then Tom Kench is not doesn't have Vanguard, so not like I'm not playing a Vanguard for the Tom Kench. And then if I reach level 10, I play Normzy if I find it. If I don't find it, it's fine. I just play some random stuff like Nora for the for the Yumi that she creates. It can heal our teammate. That we attach the Yumi to. It's not bad. Nom the Nami just obliterate my team. It's fine. Two star Nami. 55 health, but 98 gold. We go level 9 after this. Roll down. We really just need, uh, like, we have a two star this, right? We have three star this. We have a pair of this. Um, we have this already. We have this already. We just need to find the legendaries. Which, you know, is not just. That's the problem. I could play him for 3 Pyro if I don't find Diana. So that's okay, honestly. It's better to roll down at level 9 or wait a couple rounds to be 2 hit. I promise you it's better to roll down at 9. I cannot wait, I cannot skip level 9. I cannot reach level 10. Because I need so much money. In a permanent 3 star 1 cost champion. <laughs> he came back. <laughs> oh, but this guy is not even that bad. It's a decent Vanguard. It's his bonus for now, 500 health on everybody. It's pretty good. Do I have an item component? No, right? What is the most useful item component? Bow, probably. I'm pretty sure I sell this uh, Blitzcrank, right? Like, I'm pretty sure I'm not playing Vanguard. I'm pretty sure I sell this Blitzcrank. Okay, I have Varus too. I have two. I have two uh, removers as well, which is really good. I mean, I, I need to just hit here, bro. Like, I just need to hit. I don't know what to tell you. I just need to hit. It's not that hard to hit these guys. Like, bro, look. look I barely need anything. I just need the legendaries. Okay, I, I hit. I hit. 
Voidling for a round. I think I'm quite ready for a new adventure. Tread carefully. It must be done. I'm pretty sure I'm never playing her. Gold. Like, I just need a smolder. I am getting 20% bonus true damage. It's about to go to 30, by the way, just from one more charm. And then every three turns, it's gonna go up by 10%. That's actually filthy. But like, I need a smolder. I could play this instead of smolder for now. Not really though, it's pretty trash. Gain a spatula, pyro emblem. Oh, I'm down. Oh, this guy needs to go. What the frick am I doing? Oh. I'm damaged in my brain, guys. That is okay. I'm still playing that guy. Okay, but honestly, I don't have Nasus 2. So don't I have to play him? I don't have freaking Nasus 2, bro. I'm pretty sure now I go for the emblem damage, no? Bro, I'm throwing the game. But like, isn't it hard to not throw the game? Because, like, there's a lot of, like, I need Nasus too, man. I really need Nasus too, bro. Like, I really need Nasus too, man. I can't play the game. Can some people die that have Nasus? I'm pretty sure it's really contested. I need an emblem. I'll just take an emblem here if there is. Oh, Crown Guard is so good, though. Oh, there's two Crown Guard. Crown Guard for Diana is perfect. Give me the five cost. Give me the five cost. Rangard is gonna give her so much AP as well from the like when she like all the all the copies when she dies from the trench coat gain the AP. <sighs> I I really need the guy. And then I just play this over this guy. In a component anvil. Bro, it just reroll. This place needs a harsh winter. I'm pretty sure I'm dead. Like I'm I'm 100 percent sure I'm dead. I mean how much true damage do I have? 30%? I should probably use the, the other thing, right? Because this is only on ability damage. The Diana is broken though. Hopefully the Diana just 1v9s. Oh, look at this damage, bro, from Diana. Holy frick, the Diana just 1v9. And this guy has a has a Nasus, so this guy dies, which he just did. We get Nasus, guys. We can get Nasus too now. And then I might be back. I might actually win. Okay, nice. Top three is insane. Look, three four people died. Allied champions have a 50% chance to drop one gold. I'm pretty sure I want a better thing. Stun all enemies for five seconds. That's good. Okay, I'm not gonna keep rolling. So am I supposed to go true damage or am I supposed to go damage M? It's 35% damage bonus. I feel like that's just better, you know? I feel like that's just better. I feel like the 35% damage bonus on everything is better than 35% bonus true damage on um, on just abilities. But as soon as I get two more, two more charms, then the Xerath is going to be better, basically. But I'm pretty sure we're dead. Uh, we're pr I'm pretty sure we're dead. Yeah, we're dead. Okay, we try, guys. Still a good game. 
Holy frick, that was crazy. That guy is way too strong. Oh, look, okay. We lost against the ghost of the guy that hit a two-star Morgana at stage 4-3, which is obviously extremely stupid, right? And then the other guy is just the guy that rerolled all the uh, thingies, and then he somehow finds a Radiant Ginsu's, and then he just wins the game. He's level 9 with a two-star Camille as well. Okay, I mean, it is what it is. Seven multi-striker, just rerolls them, but finds them super cheap, and then just levels, just high roll. Okay. Yeah, I think we did fine. I could have, uh, these mid-game turns, I could have done a lot better, obviously, right? But it's a new set. I think it's fine. Not too bad, guys. We will take it. The build a bud into Recombobulator into another Blitzcrank. <laughs> oh, man, it is what it is. Also, I'm pretty sure if I get two stars there off, I think we remove items from the RE, but I'm not even sure. Hope you enjoyed this one, guys. Subscribe.